Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Mullen Automotive. The report was first published on our website Tuesday, May 17, 2022, but this is a more detailed version. Our aim is to help you answer the question, should I buy or sell Mullen Automotive? In this video you will get insight in both the technical and the fundamental situation in addition to future price predictions. Please remember to subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Our systems currently rank the Mullen Automotive stock with a minus 5.643 score, and our system has ranked Mullen Automotive cell candidates since April 18, 2022. In this period the stock has had a loss of minus 38.04%. This is an average return of minus 1.73% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Mullen Automotive our last headline reads, Volatile ride for Mullen Automotive Incorporated stock price on Tuesday moving between $1.08 and $1.25. The Mullen Automotive Incorporated stock price fell by minus 2.56% on the last day, Tuesday, May 17, 2022, from $1.17 to $1.14. During the day the stock fluctuated 15.74% from a day low at $1.08 to a day high of $1.25. The price has fallen in 6 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 14.29% for this period. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 10 million shares and in total, 56 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $63.92 million. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $15.90, and the lowest price was 52 cents. Right now the price is 92.83%, or $14.76, below 52-week high at $15.90, which also is all-time high for the stock. The stock is moving within a very wide and horizontal trend and further movements within this trend can be expected. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 0.98% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 37.94% and 273.4%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 93.87% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 31.02% and minus 9.04%. This equals a price between $0.79 cents and $1.04 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets From analysts Mullen Automotive Stock received a general neutral rating. The analysts give P-E ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Mullen Automotive Stock a strong sell rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for Mullen Automotive. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Mullen Automotive Incorporated stock holds a buy signal from the short-term moving average, at the same time, however, the long-term average holds a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average there is a general sell signal in the stock giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the long-term moving average at $1.77. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the short-term average at $1. A breakup through the long-term average will give another buy signal, while a fall below the short-term average will add another sell signal and strengthen the general signal. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, March 22, 2022, and so far it has fallen minus 65.56%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a buy signal. Pivots gave a sell signal 40 days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal not applicable days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal three days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a sell signal 23 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three-month chart gave a buy signal 21 days ago. 
If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average gave a buy signal 3 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a sell signal 93 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Gave a buy signal 90 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Mullen Automotive On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $1.06 and $1.03. There is natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level, since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Mullen Automotive Incorporated finds support just below today's level at $1.06. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $1.03.98. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.17 cents between high and low, or 15.74%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 19.24%. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Mullen Automotive meets first resistance at $1.24. If you do not hold Mullen Automotive shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Mullen Automotive finds first level of support at $1.06 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. In the table we have listed other potential swing trading levels based on the, the famous Fibonacci model. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Mullen Automotive is neutral. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On April 22, 2022 Sadler Carey made an inside sell of 1,000 of common stock. On April 9, 2022 Sadler Carey made an inside sell of 1,000 of common stock. On April 8, 2022 Popa Colleen made an inside buy of 100,000 of common stock. On April 7, 2022 Sadler Carey made an inside sell of 2,000 of common stock. On March 31, 2022 New Jonathan made an inside sell of 10,000 of common stock. Based on the 55 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be positive at a ratio of 26.825. In total, the insiders bought 3,511,155 and sold 2,049,082 shares in the last 55 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock no stop loss set. Is Mullen Automotive stock a buy? Mullen Automotive Incorporated holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a strong sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Wednesday 18th we expect Mullen Automotive to open up $0.0167 and start trading at $1.16. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Remember that anyone leaving a company stand the chance of winning a lifetime subscription worth $495 to our services. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get all the latest videos and updates.